Good morning, Patriots. Welcome back to Rex Pine CV. I'm Hadassah Serka. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Wednesday, April 26, 2023. Now let's take a nice and relaxing brain break. That was so calming. Now let's see what happened today in history with Peyton. Thank you, Hadassah. Hello, Patriots. Today in history, on April 26, 1989, the anime Dragon Ball Z was released as a sequel to its predecessor, a manga called Dragon Ball, which aired on Weekly Shonen Jump from 1955 to 1988. Despite having aired 34 years ago, this series is said to be one of the best anime of all time. Dragon Ball Z was a heavy inspiration for many popular animes today. Even though it's known for its bites and action, it teaches virtues such as teamwork, loyalty, and trustworthiness. Isn't it interesting how a show that aired so long ago is still popular to this day? Now let's see what's for lunch today with Zarmel. Thank you, Pan. Today's tasty lunch is hot dog, turkey ham and cheese sandwich, celery, sweet waffle fries, diced pears, and your trace of milk or juice. And tomorrow breakfast is sausage, egg, and cheese burrito, graham crackers, fresh apples, Cocoa Puffs, 100% apple juice, and no trace of milk. Students, keep in mind lunch can change at any time into our three lunch card. Don't forget to let your teachers know as we'll be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit. Now let's go back to Hadassah. Thank you, Zarmel. Students, this quarter's instructional software challenge ends on June 2nd. There is still a lot of time to complete this challenge, so check the flyer for the requirements and keep passing those lessons. Students, please don't forget our cell phone policies. It is important to make sure your phone is shut down and in your backpacks at all times. And also, don't forget you're not allowed to chew gum in school. Make sure to spit it out before entering the building. Sports fans, tomorrow our boys baseball team has a game against BMA at Driftwood Park at 4 p.m. Good luck, boys, and let's go Patriots! Patriots, tomorrow is Take Your Child to Work Day. So if you're going, make sure to have some fun! On May 23rd at 6 p.m., our Performing Arts Department will be presenting the Spring Music Concert. It is $5 cash at the door per person to get in and all funds will go towards our music department. Make sure to let your parents know so you can see a show of a lifetime. The lip sync battle is back and it will be hosted by the Pines Cheerleaders on May 18th at 6.30 p.m. If you want to sign up, make sure to stop by Ms. Stone's room or ask your teacher for permission to slash song choice of Google Play. Free shows are going to be available next week on my school books. Trust me, you do not want to miss this. Students, remember the Patriot Store is open every morning. Tomorrow morning is 7th and 8th graders' turn to go. Don't forget your tickets. Now let's see what the weather looks like with Ariel. Thank you, Hadassah. Today's weather is expected to be 86 degrees Fahrenheit and scattered thunderstorms. In other weather news, have you ever heard of the phrase, April showers bring May flowers? This phrase was created by 1500s poet Thomas Tusser. If you didn't know, this phrase he created refers to how beautiful flowers bloom in May due to all the rain from April. Some flowers that start to bloom in May include the flowering dogwood and the woodland pink root. Now let's go to Hendrik for our birthdays. Thank you, Ariel. Today's birthday boys and girls are Armando Lara, Zahir Maitland, Lucas Riveron Gonzalez, 
Abril Villanueva, and Nathan Wilson. Happy birthday. Now let's go back to Hadassah. Thank you, Hendrick Patriots. Here are PAC's expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Ms. Arnold, Ms. Stone, Ms. Merkel, Ms. Sands, Ms. June, and Ms. Grant. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's daily challenge, which was, what has 88 teeth but has never brushed them? The answer was a piano. Now for today's daily challenge. Daily challenge. Try to find the different one. Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answers to be reviewed. Winners will be announced through the next morning announcements. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a wonderful Wednesday. And remember, here at Pines, we're going to renew excellence and education. Have a great day!